Hi there, I just wanted to quick share something that I made here in the last couple days. Um, I've been working on this game with some other people. It's a sort of this blocks style game and the idea is that you have a little character that hops around in the level. But one of the things that we needed was this blocks that would fall uh, at appropriate times. So like for instance, if I kill this yellow block, the white block should not fall because it's connected here, etc. But if I kill these blue box and they're connected, the white block will fall. And now it's connected to that white block, etc, etc. So these blocks cannot fall because this is actually connecting them, etc. So now these are uh, connected, etc, etc. So this actually, the way I made this manager is I can make um, relatively large grids just on the fly. So I'm going to quick try a much larger grid system and uh, the way that Unity works I can just move the camera as I need. So there you can see it's made a, an incredibly large grid system. So before I actually play that, let's actually quit out, go to the manager again here. Instead of six times of types of colored cubes, I'm going to change that to four. And let's just try a 50 by 50, just so it's a little bit faster at making the level. Then if I change the main camera, pull back a bit, I could make this so it's automatic, but... Not all that important. There we go. And then one of the tricks I do often. Here we go. So there it is, maximized. So you can see now all these green are connected and I actually have a gizmos edition in Unity that actually will draw lines to everything that's connected at a particular frame rate hit. But not too bad. So you can just sort of click randomly if you want. Uh, let's try that again, but now I'll change it so there's only three types of prefabs. So the way it works is the prefabs dis define um, which block types and colors or whatever. So if you add more, it'll just it'll just divide out there. Alright, so there you can see there's a lot more connections. So here's like a white area that's really connected. And all that stuff will fall together. And actually if I turn the gizmos on, you can actually see some of these connections form as, as they come together. So if I kill this red, for instance, all those connections are being made. Let's see if I can build up a really big green. So anyway, that's kind of what I've been working on uh, in the last couple weeks. Thanks.